The Dots HVAC 3.0 brings many new changes to the leading HVAC simulation product line. We believe this product takes learning to the next level and we are excited to share these updates. The first enhancement you see is that electricity for HVAC is now integrated right into the product. We have combined e for h and the troubleshooting simulation to make a formidable learning package. Students can now purchase one product at the beginning of their program and use it throughout their entire curriculum knowing every student has access to over 30 interactive wiring diagrams and 180 troubleshooting faults makes using digital activities in the classroom fun and easy. The entire product has been given a new interface and back-end infrastructure. We have streamlined the process and made the product easier to use. By redesigning how the entire system works, you can now use the simulation on any browser on a desktop or laptop, and soon the simulations will have an improved performance on both the iPad and Android tablets. A big change is noticed once you begin a troubleshooting activity, and the new troubleshooting chart jumps out at you. From our user feedback, we developed a more procedural-focused chart to scaffold troubleshooting. As you go through each step, you can now use a jump link to automatically move to the part equipment needing your attention. This allows for faster repetitions, enabling students to gain the additional practice and further build their troubleshooting confidence, making them better in the field practitioners. Of course, we still have our lifelike tools and other features that have made the simulations a must-have for instructors all over the nation. Maybe the most exciting change, though, is that we added a commercial walk-in freezer. We know the industry is calling for more commercial training, and now you have the ability to give every student access to a commercial training simulator. With over 20 faults, this walk-in freezer will help instructors teach key differences between HVAC and refrigeration. It will also provide students the ability to practice valuable skills that will make them better prepared for the jobs of tomorrow. Throughout HVAC 3.0, we have developed other features to help improve the student's learning and instruction. We have integrated videos into the learning path as additional instructional tools. Our subject matter experts describe the specific fault in detail using the simulation so students can watch and learn from the expert and then go practice the concept themselves. A new badging system has been integrated across E4H and the troubleshooting simulation. Instructors can now easily assign and track badge goals, making the sims easier to implement and easier to grade. We have also fully redesigned the leaderboard feature. Not only will there still be a national leaderboard, but instructors can now make a classroom leaderboard amongst the students. This type of friendly competition can engage an entire class, and it sometimes really helps those hard-to-reach students and turn them in to the HVAC leaders you know they can be. We thank you for your time today, and you know you can always reach out to your Cengage sales rep with any questions.